wolves gave us a scepter. They will answer, should we call on them. Good. There's a shortcut to Niord's temple we can use in daylight. The Einherjar are holding fair in your father's own temple. It's been empty for as long as I can remember. There's a celestial altar across the river. According to Bigbeer, the altars were once used to signal the wolves, and now we have just the scepter to do it. When we reach the temple, I'll fire off the beacon. A signal for Bela and Birger to set off their distraction. The Dark Elf Hive. Nice to not be on the receiving end of it for once. With their attention drawn elsewhere, you and I can assault the main force from behind. While Atreus and Hildesfini slip in to rescue your brother in the confusion. Yes. Once we see their beacon, we'll regroup by the river and escape on Freyr's boat. Alpha! Hold him to the 
rallied more soldiers since our last visit. Hmm. Our disadvantages are many. Nothing good can come of this noise. <laughs> Try dragging the scepter across the bell a few times. Come on, we're making good time. Our actions in this realm follow the prophecy of the giants. Atreus believes Ragnarok is inevitable. The Norns were quite clear on the nature of prophecy. They told us the sum of our choices were predictable. But we have changed, haven't we? Perhaps. Good thing you learned the runes, brother. <laughs> 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 Careful, brother. You're covered in vine frost. The Norn said you'd kill Heimdall, but you chose not to walk that path. Back when we first met, I doubt you'd have done the same. And you? Do you still seek Ragnarok? Odin has much to answer for. If Groa's prophecy is correct, perhaps my realm can finally know peace. Perhaps I can know peace. Forgive me for being a head on a belt, but haven't we all just established how prophecy is pure havers? <sighs> Gods, Mimir. What? The most annoying man alive.
More up ahead. On your mark. On your mark. Enemy behind you, Kratos! Right side, brother! Careful, brother. You're covered in my car. Another lane, hurry up! Thank you! On your mark. Shields 
up ahead. On your mark. Switching arrows! What's your right? Careful, that's the Alpha. Tough fight. Careful, that's the Alpha. Tough fight. <laughs> Careful, that's the Alpha. Tough fight.
Careful, that's the Alpha. Tough fight. <laughs> Take it off, man! You've got that! Careful, that's the Alpha. Tough fight. Careful, that's the Alpha. Tough fight. Careful, that's the Alpha. Tough fight.
careful. That's the Alpha. Tough fight. <laughs> This way. Alas, we're on Neath Hog. It was in our way. Aye, I don't doubt it. Curious, though. What was she doing here? Odin used roots of the World Tree as part of his spell that kept me from leaving Midgard. Neathhog protects the tree's roots, wherever they are. Ah, I see. Odin used her. And she unwittingly paid the price. Classic Odin. Maybe your spear can get us across. Make extra noise once the assault begins. If we distract them long enough, Hildespini and Atreus will have more than enough time to get in and out undetected. I am not worried for Atreus. He is ready to fight on his own. This is it. There's an altar behind these vines. <laughs> Call on Skull, please. Are you ready? I am. Are you? I'm not leaving here without my brother. <clears throat> We're coming for you, Ingvi. position <laughs> what idiots no oh. if it isn't queen mistletoe herself hilarious by the way been a while i'm dull <laughs> and you must be the little half-breed's father lucky day <laughs> You have a lot to answer for, Sunshine. You too, traitor. Better a traitor than Odin's lapdog. Hmm. <laughs> no. 
Britain is mine. I can help. I know. But you are needed elsewhere. He's right, you know. Sizzles wasn't looking so hot last I saw. I know you didn't want this. But we know how this ends. See you soon. Well, we both know that's not true. <laughs> but don't worry, Frigg. I'll be coming for you and your brother as soon as I am finished here. Now, what you got? <laughs> you have survived from on me. Write him down, fool Topher. With your reputation, I thought I would at least break a sweat. Gosh, so aggressive, so angry. Did you know your 
son sounds like a goose when he gets hurt. Anyone hit me? Slow down. You think you can bring down the Asgard? Hurry up. Slow it down. Come on, brother. You hit him once. Just gotta find the right opening. Strike like a sloppy cow! 
Spare me out of pity. <laughs> Let it go, you may live. Is this about the little runt? Oh, now I am definitely going to cut him. This is your final warning. I don't think a warning is going to cut it. You think you get to just walk away? No. That is not how this works. You do not get to decide my fate! You are dead. Only one of us is walking away. 
away from this. And it's sure as shit will not be you! You are in way over your head! Don't you know who I am? I am the Watchman of the AC, the Herald of Ragnarok! I am going to find that little mockerel of yours and beat his face into a pulp! Only one of us is walking away from you. And it's sure as shit will not be you! Slow down!
Aesir, the Herald of Ragnarok! I am going to find that little mockerel of yours and beat his face into a pulp! Only one of us is walking away from this. And it sure as shit will not be you. How dare you try and spare me? Kratos, that was just... Uh, I don't know if we are breaking fate, or fate's breaking us. At least the rescue's going well. Yeah! <laughs> 
To move. I will carry him. You what? No, I can make it. You cannot. Ow, ow, ow! Easy. To me! Follow! We, uh, got company back here. Keep going on! 
We're almost at the river! Uh, that girl? Where's the boat? Throw it in the river. Hurry now. That won't hold them for long. Whoa! Of course! There's Eastport near. Freya's boat. They will regroup. We should go. seeing your faces. <laughs> Relax. It's flying. We're flying. I knew it would do that. think that's the end of Birger? You think he survived that? He's down there picking the dirt out of his nails with the beast's feathers. You'll see. He... Uh, <laughs> he has to be. We're almost there, Ingvi. Just hold on a bit longer. I don't suppose I have much of a choice at the moment. Lunda! 
Plunda, we need cloth and boiling water. Red root and lamb's crest. I know, I know. You think I never staunch a bleeder before? Oh, now don't you go worrying, boss. I didn't go through any of your stuff while you was off being tortured. Ah, damn it, Plunda. Easy. Heck, you says it made for. I ain't the one who stuck you like a damn pig. No offense. Freya, mind giving her a hand? We're just taking over entirely? Hold still. She'll just get you stable so I can take you to Sindri's house. The rest of my herbs are there. We'll protect the realm in your absence. The four of us. Vanaheim's in good hands. Party at Sindri's house, huh? Whoever that is. Your boat. Nope. Your boat. Go on. Take it. Sail the skies. Sun yourself on its bow. You look like you could use it. <laughs> Make a Vanir god proud. He gave you his boat? Nice. He left me no choice. Because it was necessary, not because it was written. Prophecy holds that Galahorn is the herald of Ragnarok. Whatever it does. I read about it in Nolan's library. Supposedly it. Hold it, Treus. We will discuss in private. <laughs> oh, definitely need that. Ready when you are. Something for the kid? We got more lip flapping to do or no? Heimdall is dead. Good. Is it? Look, I don't know from faith, but I know Heimdall was a prize winning taint stain with the capital stank. If he was gonna hurt your boy, it's a good thing he ain't around no more. The Norns didn't quite see it that way. The opinion of them three shut-in spinsters ain't worth a goat fart in a hurricane. You did what you did. No need to fret about it. Hope you and your loin sprout ain't got any holes where you don't want them. We are fine. Oh, honey, you don't have to worry about him. Gave him a once over, just as soon as Freyr was patched up and on his way. Did you now? <laughs> to decide whether or not to abandon this camp. Its location may now be compromised. 
I was not following. If I am sure of I am sure of that. What does that mean? Helka smells something. Could be important. Maybe we should follow her. We found the consul's journal. Thank you, Kratos. It is exactly what we will. The consul is everything to understand. Helka's. Where are you leading us, girl? What do you want to do now? We don't have to go straight home, do we? Look! Tracks from the olfactorily gifted hound. Seems we're on the right path. Hey, girl, we're here. Guess we should follow her. More of Helka's tracks. I dare say she's got as skilled a nose for hunting as you, brother. Hers is superior. The eyes can lie. The nose cannot. Does that make you wish you could turn into an animal every once in a while? No. And there she goes. <laughs> that ridge, but we can't follow her at this time of night. <gasps> us to rescue him. Oh, oh, oh. You can head back now, Halka. We'll take it from here.
How could Birger have survived a fall like that? Magic, perhaps. Let's make sure to ask once we've extricated him from this situation. Should be easy to find Birger from up here. Why'd everyone sound so scared of this place? Eh, uh, on that note... Dragon! Oh! I'm fine. You? Hmm. Well, he seemed angry. What do you suppose that means? We are going the right way. Where are we anyway? Looks to be the ruins of a once thriving Vanier settlement. What happened? Don't rightly know. More reason to find a way out. Signal! Yuger's alive! Not for long if that dragon has its way. It will not. Do you see what I'm seeing? A lightning bolt. Except... it's... frozen? Like the one made in my fight with Thor. But why would there be one just like it here in Vanaheim? The dragon's back, and it's angry! Oh, how flattering. It's flying away! Strike and retreat tactics. Smart. It doesn't like us invading its territory. Oh, 
Oh! 
that journal he dropped could tell us more. That lies. Written by Birka. Perhaps that's who this fella has it out for. Oh, feel that? Where's it coming from? Down there. Another one of those mysterious crystals. Ah! <laughs> 